What is up, everybody? Trippin' ain't easy back here. Today we are at the Kiwanis Club Shrimp Feast, as you can see here, out here at Chesapeake City Park, right here adjacent to the beautiful Chesapeake Jubilee. It's a very nice day outside right now. They haven't done this in uh, since COVID. So this is the first time they come back. This is an all-you-can-eat and all-you-can-drink event. Shrimp, barbecue, coleslaw, hush puppies, the works. 45 a ticket and, uh, you know, kind of benefits charity. A lot of sponsors out here. Well, we try to come here every year, but they stopped doing it due to COVID. So now we're out here. We're going to get some barbecue. We're going to get some shrimp. We're going to have lots of beers, all self-service, and it's going to be awesome. So let's check it out. Bruh. All right, let's go get some grub. We'll head up into the tent now. Let's get some scrimp and barbecue. How are you? Yes, how are you? Can I get one for the wife as well? Yes. I promise oh, it's sorry. not for me. <laughs> it's okay. All right, this one, that was pretty good. Mmm, uh, so good and tasty. Uh, yeah, if you want to check this out, Kiwanis Club, uh, they do it every year here if you're in the area. Just want to take a little second here to thank everybody. We hit a little milestone for YouTube. Uh, I know it's not a big one, it's not a huge one, but for us it was a cool little milestone. We hit 200 subscribers uh, as of a couple days ago. So we really thank you guys for the support, for the help. We have, I think, over 32,000 views on our channel. We have quite a bit of views. It couldn't have been possible without you guys. If you're watching this video and you're not subscribed, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button and hit that bell. It really helps us out quite a bit. But we're going to keep on hanging out here at the Chesapeake Jubilee Shrimp Feast. We might head on into the Jubilee after this. So uh, I'm going to go grab another beer because I'm out and it's all you can drink. So why not? Mmm, some more chef's puppies and scram. And more beer. And lovely ladies. Thank you so much for hanging out. Neat shrimp. All right, so the shrimp fest is over. It is now 7.30, it's ended. We're gonna head on into the Jubilee now. Got the little lady in the back there. We're gonna head into the Jubilee. Uh, look around there, got a nice little crowd going on inside of there. Some rides and all kinds of stuff, funnel cakes and stuff. So we'll show you a little around inside of there before we uh, end the video. So the last time the wife and I came here, we uh, went to one of the carnival games, and apparently I uh, would try to win her a Rasta banana, and I think I had had uh, so much of the all you can drink at the shrimp fest that I must have forgotten, because I didn't win it here, but a Rasta banana showed up at our door from Amazon a few days later that I guess I, in my frustration, ordered off of that, so. Yeah, what like the Ross banana she wanted was like this big, but I think the one we got was like it's like two foot, but the one she wanted was like three or four foot. But yeah, I ended up getting the Ross banana delivered to the house. We're gonna see if we'll see if there's one here. Yeah, we'll see if there's one here and we'll show you the one that we tried to win. Of course that was years and years ago, but yeah, we'll check it out. Four chops on a stick. Perky legs. Everyone. As you can see here, standard carnival. All kind of games, rides, funnel cakes, fried Twinkies and shit. I haven't seen the Rasta banana yet. 
I see a Rasta monkey, but I don't see a Rasta banana. All right, we're trying a little carnival game. Uh, if I hit, I win. If I miss, I don't pay, right? So I'm going to try to go for a small one and see if we can hit one. All right, I caught one. So that's the small ones there. All right, if I play again, I'll get 20 bucks right now if I want to stop. Now if I play again, I can hit one of the medium ones over here. Right here, this row here. So now it's up to the wife holding the camera. Hold the camera if I uh, if I go for it again. Do I go again or I stop? All right, I'm going again. Are you, you, you got ten bucks? All right. Hey, got a medium. All right, I got the medium prize. Now again, that's and that's it. Two, you get if I hit the, oh, I have to hit two more. Yeah. Then I get a large. Two so is so is that ten more dollars? Yes. That's ten more dollars. So that'd be twenty bucks. All right, so we're going to cut it right now, 10 bucks. I win the medium. So whichever one she wants from any of those, I'm guessing she's going to pick the avocado. Orange and puppy, which one do you want? All right, she wants the puppy. What color? What color? Oh, uh... Brown? Brown? Okay. Right. Thanks for my phone. Hey. You gotta pay for it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, you're one. You're one. Oh, yeah, I don't want to forget that thing. Jesus. What's your name? Pete. Pete. So, Pete is apparently in a book. Uh, what's the name of the book? Nebraska, you happen to know? Nebraska 24 7. Nebraska 24 7. You are a. I, I don't want to. I don't want to use it as a carny. Is that, is that an okay term or no? Concessions. Concessions. Carnival concessions. Carnival concessions. How long have you been doing it? 35 years. 35 years. You travel all over the U.S., bro? That's, that's pretty yeah, awesome. Everything between Puerto Rico, Alaska, and Hawaii, except for Vermont. Except for Vermont. Why not Vermont? Never made it up that way. Never. <laughs> been in Maine, been well, all over. Hopefully one day you'll make it up there, man. Appreciate it. Have a good one. And you can't have any carnival experience without a funnel cake. So we're in line right now. We're going to grab a funnel cake. They got a bunch of other stuff. Deep fried Twinkies, fried Oreos, all kind of stuff. But we're going to grab a funnel cake. So... It's gonna be pretty good. Thank you, sir. <laughs> All right, so we got our funnel cake there. And then we got our, this is our deep fried Reese's. I think it's a Reese's cup. It's pretty thick for a Reese's cup though, but we'll try it. We'll see, we'll, we'll see what we're working with there. So this was like, the, the funnel cake was like eight bucks. And I heard somebody that, of course, knew somebody that knew somebody that said these cost like a nickel a piece, I think. No, it's just flour. flour like, eggs. like pancake batter or something like that. Again, thank you guys for helping us hit 200. I know it's small compared to some of the YouTubers out there, but it's a pretty big gain for us, you know. About a year ago when we started the channel, we weren't sure where we were going to be or, you know, if anybody was going to watch us, but, you know, you guys have uh, sort of put us above our expectations, I guess you would say, but, you know, if you're watching this and you're not subscribed, please, please subscribe. Get that little uh, bell icon. It helps us out a lot. You know, helps us keep going, bringing new content to you. Let's check out these little deep fried uh, Reese's Pieces here. I got diabetes just eating that. Just taking one bite of that. Oh my god. I'm just taking a bite it's, of that. Um, it's different. It's like a, uh, a essentially a Reese's Pieces wrapped in a funnel cake. Yeah, that's pretty much what it is. Peanut butter chocolate. They batter the funnel cake and then 
throw it in the fryer and it puffs up. Yeah, this event goes on for a few days. They got fireworks one of the nights, some live bands, that kind of stuff. Lots of games, lots of rides, as you saw. Pretty cool thing to take the family to. We do it yearly, around the same time every year. It's a bit expensive, though. So it's free to get into the Jubilee. But, of course, the shrimp feast is like 45 a ticket. Sometimes they will do a, like, ticket special. Well, they didn't do one this year, I'm guessing, because they haven't done the shrimp feast in, like, a few years since COVID. So they, they wanted, you know, they wanted as much money as they could get, you know, understandably. But, uh, yeah, if you catch them, you know, in one of their usual years, they usually have, like, a two-for-sixty deal, something like that for that, you know. Fill up on shrimp and barbecue and beer, come on over here, ride a few rides, puke, you know, all that stuff, play some games. I'm not even sure how we're fitting this in, to be honest with you, because we have so much barbecue and shrimp. But we're doing it for you guys, you know? Th this is for you. We're making ourselves miserable for you. I just want to buy a little piece. I don't like pieces. I can't believe you've done this. Swallow. Swallow. We tried to get the fried Snickers. They were out of that. Fried Twinkie, they were out of that. There's a thing called the elephant ear. I'm not sure what that is. They were out of that. So they were out of quite a few things. And this is the first night of the Jubilee, which is crazy. So hopefully they'll have it later. I don't think they think the car is as busy as it would be. I don't I think they thought it would be as busy as it is. I know it's really hot, though. I know that. Not or not nice now. Though. Now it's really cool, but earlier it was scorching. And I think tomorrow is supposed to be like 90s. It's supposed to be really hot tomorrow. But, you know, we appreciate you guys coming out, checking us, watching us. You know, all the support that we've gotten over the past year and some change. Hope you continue to watch us. Leave a comment down below. Any sort of event, festival, restaurant, brewery in your area that's your favorite. And maybe we might try to make it out there. Other than that, we're going to, uh, you know, finish this up. Grab an Uber home, we're gonna do the responsible thing and not drink and drive. So, as always, tripping ain't easy, but it show sure is fun.